Hello everyone, in this INR number 41, we are going to discuss about a very important topic that is molecular classification of the breast cancers, right? So often you will be getting one or two questions from here. So what is molecular classification of breast cancer? Before I start, I would like to say that, please remember my words. This has been verified from the Bailey's 28th edition also. I have followed Devita's oncology latest update. And then I also have followed Cecil textbook and Harrison 21st edition. So all of the thing I have seen in according to the Robbins also all the standard textbook I have seen and then I have prepared and this is the latest and the most correct classification. So please do not get deviated in your exam. So just try to uh, try to understand this. I'm telling you, you will be having 100% correct answer in your exam. Don't get any deviation if, if something is you are hearing uh, away from this, right? So what are these things? Molecular classification, we are dividing them into luminal, HER2, basal and cloudin low. So luminal, HER2, basal and cloudin low. What is luminal? Luminal will be having common things. What are the common things? ER positive, BR positive and BRCA2 positive. Why I said luminal will be having common? Because luminal we are dividing into type A and type B. I again repeat, luminal has been divided into type A and type B. And luminal will be having ER positive, PR positive, BRCA2 positive. These are the things which will be common to both A and B, right? That is what I mean to say that. So what is the difference? A and B, when you will see what is the classification, luminal A followed by HER2. So whatever is near to HER2, that will be positive. This is the way we can remember. So type B is HER2 positive and away from the HER2, which is type A will be negative. Right, so this is the point you have to remember. So luminal are ERPR positive, BRCA2 positive, but luminal type A, apart from ERPR positive, they will be HER2 negative. Luminal type B, ERPR positive and HER2 positive. Another basic difference between them is, when you see the CHI-16 index, this is the proliferation index for the tumor. So CHI-67 will be less than 14% for luminal A. Remember, CHI-67 is less than 14% for luminal A. Apart from that, from here onwards, whatever cancer you are seeing here, all will be having CHI-67 more than 14%. That is what I want to say. Only one tumor, which is uh, only one, one type of subtype of the breast cancer, which will be having less than 14% is the luminal type A. Apart from that, everybody will be having more than 14, 14%, right? So CHI-67 in type B will be more than 14% and it will be for all other classification also. So type B is the HER2 positive, CHI-67 is more than 14% because it is HER2 negative and proliferation index is low, so it is having good prognosis. Whereas type B, HER2 positive, CHI-67 is high, means proliferation is high, so they will have bad prognosis. HER2, as you can see the name itself is telling, only one thing will be positive and that is HER2. ERPR will be negative, right? So HER2 is positive, ERPR negative, right? Prognosis because HER2 is positive, so prognosis will be poor, right? Basal, basal means at the base and at the base everything will be negative. So ER negative, PR negative, HER2 negative, all will be negative. That is why these breast cancers are also called as triple negative breast cancer. Right, so basal triple negative breast cancer is BRCA1 positive and they are having worse prognosis amongst all subtypes. Right, next comes the cloudin low. Cloudin low is having decreased expression of the cloudin. Cloudin is a intercellular addition molecule and they will be also having decreased E cadherin, which is another important addition molecule. Right, so cloudin is also low, E cadherin is also low, so ER, PR will be negative, HER2 will be negative, just like a triple negative. But remember, they will have poor prognosis, but basal will be having worse prognosis. Please remember, basal will be having worse prognosis, cloud in low will be having poorer prognosis. They are also triple negative, right? So this is the molecular classification of the breast cancer, which I have told you, right? Now I want to tell you how you are going to correlate with immunohistochemistry. So examiner will give you one row of the uh, uh, histopathological examination, like a HE section, and then you can see they will be giving you IHC of the estrogen receptor, progesterone receptor and HER2. Now we are going to see and connect with the molecular classification. But before that, I want to tell you about the immunohistochemistry. Immunohistochemistry, there are two type of interpretation. Either you will see the brown color or you will see the pale blue color. Remember when you find brown color, it will be considered as positive. 
once again i repeat if you find brown color it is positive if it is pale blue color it means it is negative and whenever you find the positive that means it is because of diamino benzidine this was the question in this inict exam 2023 november inict exam this was the question ihc is brown in color because of which compound because of diamino benzidine so whenever you are seeing pale blue color so all these are negative whenever you find brown color all these are positive so brown color positive brown color positive right blue color negative pale blue color negative brown color is positive because of diamino benzidine so let us look one by one if i am saying this column number 1 right look at this er is positive pr is positive both are brown her2 is pale blue negative so what is this er pr positive her2 negative er pr positive her2 negative that means luminal a good prognosis now look at this second column second column what we are seeing brown color positive er is positive pr is also positive her2 is also positive means all three are positive because all three are brown so er pr her2 are positive so that will be a luminal b type of breast cancer now look at the third column in this column what we are seeing er is negative because pale blue pr is also pale blue so er pr both are negative but her2 is positive so right so er negative pr negative her2 is positive so this is her2 type of breast cancer now look at the fourth column pale blue pale blue pale blue all three are blue so means er pr her2 all are negative and this is triple negative basal type of breast cancer right so these are the simple thing which we have connected with the ihc also so bre breast cancer molecular classification we have clubbed with ihc and remember ihc is also called as brown revolution in pathology brown revolution is name given to the ihc and this brown color is because of diamino benzidine so keep revising this topic very important for all the exams best wishes to all of